right. Yeah, so rough waters. <laughs> rough waters ahead. <laughs> yeah. But the good news is no one has said we're crazy and no one has said it's not realistic to move on to the sailboat. So that's still the plan. Hopefully we're getting discharged today and we have a whole slew of other appointments we need to get to, but then the plan is that we will get back on the boat. So we're just gonna share some of our story over this hurdle that we have for rough water. Well, today's the day going in for the spinal fusion surgery and I guess an hour and a half. They're gonna come in to get me right now. Morning, Jaya. This is Christina. We're from the OR. Okay. Taking you down for your procedure. Yeah. Uh, can I just get your name and date of birth? All right. You're in final words here as we head out of your room. I'm getting it done. I'm smiling. You're smiling. Going down. Prepped for surgery. So slightly awake. First steps after surgery. Are your legs feeling weak? Okay. Aaron's going for another walk. I'm really liking the pink belt. I feel like one of the king's guards. <laughs> yeah, you're doing great. Can we go around the block? Yeah. All the way around? Yeah. Wow. I think he's gonna get discharged tomorrow at this rate. This is gonna be a this is a workout. Yeah. It really is. Yeah. You should have put your Apple Watch on. <laughs> yeah, I had that on days. This is great. You walked the entire floor. Look, the tricky part is navigating the room. It's like an obstacle course. How are you feeling? You want me to get the belt off? I'm kind of like that. You're kind of like It's like a wrestling belt. <laughs> WWF, but all right. So we're gonna practice like at home. We're gonna flatten out the bed because you don't have rails at home, right? On the bed, right. so we're going flat. Okay. I'm gonna take you. You weren't a big fan of pink, so you're a black belt today. Ooh, that feels like progress. Everyone stiff as a board after back surgery. Nice and tall. Hands on the walker. Get your feet where you want them for balance. Out the door when you're ready. Relax your shoulders. It's a hard thing to do. And you did steps already? Steps? Uh -huh. Oh no, no steps. We haven't right. done steps. Yeah. Oh. How do you do steps with a walker? No, we don't. Oh, you just hold the random? Uh -huh. You want to try it? No. Not that bad. <laughs> I love this guy. Not We're bad going at all. sailing. These, this is the. This is what we want. Oh, the steps are right here. You can do this. I promise. This is like fear factor. I'm right here with you. Aim from that wall and hold up the wall while we talk about it. Stand on one rail. One step at a time. Okay. One more. How was that? That was great. <laughs> it was so great. So I just wanted to tell you I'm really proud of you. Yeah. I know that was tough. Getting out of bed is the worst. Yeah. It really is. Yeah, and the more you do it, the easier it will get. But actually, I, I gotta say, I'm quite impressed. I mean, you did the stairs today. Yeah. On two days post-op. That's pretty incredible. I was a little, I have to be honest, I was a little bit concerned when he said you were going to do the stairs. Especially since the lady was yesterday all concerned about whether or not we had stairs where we lived. Right. So everyone's been real supportive. We're still on track for sailing. And adjust. We can't change the wind. Right. And we can adjust the sails. And the plan is still the plan. It's just a long shoehorn. As tall as you are, you will appreciate it. It makes it easier to slide your shoes on. Works great with loafers, deck boat shoes, sneakers, anything like that. Yeah. I like how she said boat shoes. Yes. <laughs> A grabber! Yes. For everything you drop on the floor. So you can use this to push your socks off. I guess you want me to take my socks off. Yes, because oh, I'm going to show you practice that. how to put them back on. Oh. Yeah, I think putting them back on might be a little more difficult. It's different. Yeah. Sock putter on. You're going to take the sock and you're going to pull it on here. 
you're gonna pull it all the way so the toe is flat to the end. It leaves it nice and open for you. So if it's longer, you just kind of bunch it up a little bit. It's on a rope, so you don't have to bend over again. Yeah. Put your toes in, take both ropes. You are going to pull until the white hard piece comes out the back and up the leg. Yeah. Keep pulling, keep going. Voila. Mm -hmm. Second session of PT today, and it is, is this day two post-surgery? Doing it without the walker. We're gonna try the stairs again. Set that out of time, right? How many steps are you doing? Oh, we did three this morning. They're already there. Somebody, you turn after this step. Forward the rail, and back down. That was, was that five? Mm-hmm. Six, six. Tell me about the boat. Do you know, it's an odyssey. There you go. How long you had it? We picked this one up May 27th. Definitely not your first you. boat. No. It's our second boat. But it's just the second boat, okay? We started sailing in 2020. Yeah, we're pretty new to sailing. What's the uh, what's your favorite destination so far? Well, we've mostly just sailed the Chesapeake. Okay. But we did charter a sailboat in the Virgin Islands. We got married last summer. Oh. I was trying a little trickery there. Didn't I work. know. I know. <laughs> she didn't catch on. I got it. She's has to answer all the questions. <laughs> Sorry, I got excited. <laughs> <laughs> Tell them about the sailboat show though, because that was pretty cool. Ah, yes. Sailboat show's not cheap <laughs> to attend, but we got in for free for the all the days and got free dock space right outside the sailboat show. How'd you manage that? We volunteered, or we were volunteered, to do the take the wheel program. You made it. You gonna go around twice? No. Are you sure? Should I? Yeah. Kenny? Absolutely. It's up to you. Listen to your body. You want a little sip break and then do it? Do it? Maybe to the end. Okay. All right, keep telling the story, though. It's a good story. We had a dock right outside of the sailboat show itself. Okay. Or right in the sailboat show. We had night passes <laughs> since we sit. stayed on our boat. That's cool. Not it very many night. people get to do that. One, one security guard said, I've never seen night passes before. <laughs> All right, here you are, my friend. I was having a good day because I got out of bed early this morning and it didn't seem like too much pain, but it's been downhill ever since. <laughs> One well, he did six steps uh, is what he did the other day. Excellent, a whole flight of stairs. Don't look down. How does it feel? Fine. Good. Your legs feel stable? Yeah. Good. Yeah, so I feel better that you did the whole, even though we don't have stairs yeah. to navigate, it's just good to oh, get that so common. All right. So scripts were sent down for you. A lot of follow-up appointments, which is kind of what Kelly said too. And then we also have home health set up for him as well. Okay. Um, and their number is here. Then we also want to follow up with radiation oncology. Um, this is everything in regards to your back surgery. So activity right now should just be walking. I know PT kind of went over the whole speech with you multiple times, um, but right now just walking. Um, as PT said, do not lift anything over five pounds, no bending or twisting. Okay, so I'm gonna have you sign this paper for me. It's just saying we're gonna over just charge paperwork together. Right. And you'll get to keep this packet as well. Okay. And I'm gonna go grab some gauze and stuff to get his IV out as well. Oh, okay. Cause that, that's <laughs> so we're all registered in and we're at the Radiation Oncology Department. Yep, first dose of radiation going to occur today, mm -hmm. and then it'll be a 10-dose regiment, so we'll be a total of 10 doses every single day. We'll take weekends off. I don't know how long it is. It'll be done on November 21st, just before Thanksgiving. Yep. Uh, well, phase one was the surgery. This is phase two of the treatment, and then yep. it'll be the radioactive iodine for phase three. And I don't know if we said before, but the actual oncology report was that it's thyroid cancer. Mm -hmm. 
uh, that has metastasized into the spine, which uh -huh. caused some of the deterioration of the spine of the vertebrae, and then uh, a little bit in the lungs as well. So the first course of the cancer treatment is the radiation, right. and then we'll go into the, I think, the radioactive iodine to wipe out the rest of it in the body. So it's actually good news that it's that type of cancer as opposed to something else. Okay. Yes, and we feel very hopeful, and they're calling you already. Right, this is an exciting times. day. You ready? Ready. Completion. It says ring this bell three times. Well, three times well. It's a total clearly say my treatment is done. The course is run and I'm on my way. Yay! <laughs> Do you want a picture out there without the side? Yes. Okay. Yes, there you go. Thank you so much. You're very welcome, guys. Thank you. Congratulations.